close your want that privilege that better thing to start now and that eternal life to start now wherever you are you raise up your hand god bless you there raise up that hand very well god bless you there god bless you there online you are there you want that better thing to happen to you and for the lord to put your name indelibly forever in the book of life anywhere you are over the radio over the television online and here the alpha location great things happening now raise up that hand if you're raising up your hand you'll stand up wherever you are you're raising up your hand you'll stand up god bless you there god bless you there stand up stand up stand up and say yes i want that life of christ I want that better life, and I want uh, that better future. I want that eternal life. Stand up wherever you are. I want the forgiveness of my sin, and I want God to take away my name out of the book of sinners and the book, uh, the book of criminals, and bring that name, my name, in the book of life. Wherever you are, stand raise up your hand and stand up. As you're standing up, tell the Lord, Oh Lord, here I am. Here I am. I am. I thank you for a great thing happening to me today. I thank you for your grace happening to me today. I thank you for lifting me up from that humiliation. And you are leaving me, you are, uh, you are leading me to divine honor. Stand up and tell the Lord that and turn your back on the ways of the world and turn your back on Babylon and turn your back on the lifestyle of defilement in Babylon and come to the new life that Christ, our Redeemer, our Savior, is calling us to right now a higher life, a brighter life, a better life, eternal life. As we're standing, I'm going to pray with you now. Keep up your hand as I pray with you here at the Alpha location on radio television, online, everywhere. This prayer is for you now. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you. Lord, we have turned away from the lifestyle of Babylon and we come into the kingdom of God right now. Receive everyone in Jesus' name. Forgive their sin. Blot out all their transgression and all those evil things of the past they have done that made their names to be in the book of sinners and criminals. Lord, forgive and cleanse them. Wash them whiter than snow and let eternal life come into them right now. And the grace to live in life transformed by the grace of God grant to everyone right now. Confirm that salvation, the peace of mind, that joy of salvation in every heart now. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. God bless you. Keep on standing. Our counselors are there and uh, they will interact with you, ask you questions, and then uh, they want to put your name down as somebody whose name has entered into the book of life. After that, shortly now, I've come back to pray for you. Healing, deliverance, miracles, signs, and wonders for every one of you tonight in Jesus' name. We call on our state pastor uh, to lead us in this time of counseling. You couldn't have made a better decision. The decision you made now to give your life to the Lord Jesus Christ is the most glorious, the most blessed decision you could have made. And you have made it. Congratulations. So give all the necessary information as the counselors are by you. And if you are watching online and you also gave your life to Christ after the pastor's message, Look very well, there is a link on your screen below your player there. Click on it and fill the form so that we can assist you further in your new work with Christ. The link is just there on your screen below there. Click on it 
complete the form that appears to you there. And when you do that and you send it, it will assist us to give you further assistance in your new work with the Lord. Remember, you made a great decision. It's glorious. You couldn't make a better decision than that. And if you were connected to all through the radio of, te of television, there is a link to look at the number, the WhatsApp plus two three four nine one five four 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 nine two six three. Send your name, your phone number, your location address via SMS or WhatsApp to that number. The number again, plus two three four nine one five four 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 nine two. Six three. Send your name, your phone number, your location address, via SMS or WhatsApp to that number. And for those of us that are here at the Alpha location, there'll be a special meeting, lunch hour with Jesus. For all those who gave their lives to Jesus. And that meeting will hold tomorrow by 2.30 p.m. at the campus hall. If you are seeing me, just look at where I'm pointing to. On my own right-hand side, the building that I'm pointing to there, that is the campus hall. And for you facing this podium, the building on your left-hand side, by 2.30 p.m., the launch hour with Jesus we hold there. And the counselors should please further remind them. Every convert of tonight's program is expected there. 2.30 p.m. tomorrow. Launch hour with the Lord Jesus Christ. There you will be greatly assisted. You will be mightily blessed. Don't forget those of us who are online. See the link. gckhq.org slash connect. Click on it and you will see a form there. Complete the form and send it. It will enable us to help you more so that you can stay victorious, you can remain steadfast, and you can be more blessed in this new life that the Lord is bringing you into. And those of us on, I mean, at the Alpha location here, give all details, all details. The exact name by which you are known in your neighborhood. And the counselors should please check the phone numbers that the digits are complete. Let's try and move fast because there are so many of them there. And counselors, well, remember to stay with them for the miracle prayer. Don't forget, if you are watching online, 
and you have your screen, whether through your telephone, your iPad, or whatever equipment you are using, you will see a link appearing at the bottom of the screen there. gckhq.org slash connect. Just click on it. It will open up a form unto you. Then complete the form. This will help us to give you further help so that you can your name, your address via SMS or WhatsApp to this number plus two three four nine one five four 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 nine two six three from anywhere, whether from Nigeria, whether from other countries in Africa, whether from the Oceania, Australia, New Zealand, Solomon Islands, whether from Asia, whether from Europe, whether from America, North and South. It's all the same, we will receive that. Counselors who have finished, you please remain with the people so that you can be of further assistance to them during the prayers. If we have landed drop, can we just wave and know that we are finished? At the far back, close to the road, close to the gate. If you are finished, can you just wave from the far back so that you know that you are through there? From the, at the far back, can you wave, wave, wave? Yes, yes, thank you, we can see. Let us see from other parts of the far back there, whether you are finished. All right, thank you. In the middle area, have we finished? If we have finished, okay, we are seeing some hands waving. Let's see, let's just see from the far end of the middle area towards the campus hall. Have we finished middle area towards the campus block? We're not seeing any hand there yet. It appears perhaps we are still busy there. Then towards the far left hand side, towards the fence, middle area. We finished. Thank you very much. Already we see some hands there. Meanwhile, I want to implore you to bow down your heads and begin to pray in earnest expectation of what God will do for you tonight. It is this night that the Lord is beginning with you. The Lord is visiting you. Prayers will be made for you soonest. And your better days are commencing. Your complete triumph commencing. Already the transformation has begun with those who have given their lives to Christ. And there is nobody who does not need a great transformation. Everybody needs great transformation for better times. So begin to pray, begin to commit yourself unto the Lord. And at your very point of need, at your very area of need, trust God. He will meet with you. The Lord delights in your great transformation. He delights in your total triumph. No, don't say, I will wait for tomorrow. That Lord, even if I don't have it today, I'll get it tomorrow. No, why not today? Why not today? God wants you to experience him tonight. 
in a transformational dimension for complete total triumph. It's available for you. Why don't you get up on your feet now and get ready? Of course, the man of God is ready. Heaven is ready. And the windows will soon open for you. And showers of blessing that will effect great transformation in your life for total triumph will come upon you. Yeah, it's already approaching. Yeah, welcome, sir. <clears throat> Praise the Lord. Your time has come. The healing has come. Deliverance has come. Better life. Better future. Starting right now, right there. Any challenge you have, you lay one hand on yourself, raise up the other hand, indicating to God that, Lord, I'm here waiting for my miracle. That miracle will reach you there right now. After the final amen, take up yourself. It's there already. Father, in Jesus' name, to all for us today, those of us here at the Alpha location, everyone online, in every congregation and community and country, Lord, I pray that transformation was the power Power to heal, power to save, power to deliver, power to set free. Manifest it now in Jesus' name. Any infirmity, any sickness, any disease, anywhere, Lord, touch your people now. Heal your people now. Deliver your people now. Give everyone the miracle right now. Blind eyes, I command you, be open and begin to see. Deaf ears, open up and begin to hear. Dumb tongues, be loosened in Jesus' name. I pray for those who have insanity, mental problem. Be healed and delivered in Jesus' name. Yeah. Swelling in your body. That goiter, come out in Jesus' name. Fibroid, come out in Jesus' name. Elephantiasis, come up in Jesus' name. The swelling of cancer. Be healed in Jesus' name. That water head, big head, I pray that the water there will be flushed out by the power of God, become normal in Jesus' name. Ulcer, oh, you are healed in Jesus' name. Cancer, you are healed in Jesus' name. Kidney failure, you are healed in Jesus' name. And that spinal cord that has been affected, I pray the Lord will strengthen that spinal cord now. Stand straight, walk straight, be healed in Jesus' name. With that hand, be healed in Jesus' name. Short leg, grow out equal to the other in Jesus' name. Paralysis, stroke, you are healed in Jesus' name. Everywhere, to my right, to my left, at the back, in the front. Healing for everyone in Jesus' name. Over the radio there, over the television there, online, in every country. I pray miracle signs and wonders will float your life right now. Lord, confirm it for everyone. Joy everywhere. Joy of healing joy of deliverance and joy of a new life in Jesus name thank you Lord thank you Lord 
it is done. In Jesus' name, I pray. You have got it. It's right there. Check up yourself. You'll find your healing miracle there in Jesus' name. Amen. Quiet everywhere. Over and over you had in Jesus' name from our Father in the Lord. No problem can we stand that name. I said no problem can we stand that name. Every problem you brought here melts now under the name of Jesus in Jesus' name. Shake your body now and as you hear you will shout praise the Lord. Heaven will shout with you today. I say heaven will shout with you today. What you cannot do before, begin to do right now. The name of Jesus has never failed. Where are you? We are waiting for you now. Who will be the first to shout, praise the Lord there? Waiting for you. A miracle is there. I say your miracle is there. Check your body right now. What you cannot do, begin to do right now. Cancel us. Check on them, help them. You came on wish share, right? So begin to push that wish share right now. You are using any crutches, raise it up and let everybody see that God has done something for you. Orchestra, you can come forward. Orchestra, you can come forward. I'm waiting for your testimony. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Shout of joy everywhere. Shout of joy everywhere. From the back, to the front, to the center, everywhere now. Every problem must melt under the name of Jesus. No problem can, can remain. Over and over, you had in Jesus' name. Where are you? We're waiting for your testimony. Yes, over there. Yes, over there. Can we have a shout hallelujah over there? Your miracle is here. Say, my miracle is there. I've received my miracle. If you have received, come forward now. God bless you. There is joy there. There is joy there. It is happening. It is happening. It is happening. Put your hands together. Put your hands together. Stroke is healed. Yes, you can see the man walking now. It's your turn. It's your turn. Online, online. Check up also if you have just received your miracle. You come and share with us. God bless you. You can see the walking stick now. No more. Every problem must crumble under the name of Jesus. At the name of Jesus, every knee must bow. Cancer must bow tonight. Paralysis must bow tonight. Blindness must bow tonight. Fibroid must bow tonight. Can I see a hand over there? It's happening over there. It's happening over there. Perfect healing. Total healing. It's happening at the back over there. There's a miracle happening over there. There's a miracle happening over there. Come forward, come forward, come forward, come forward. No problem can stand the name of Jesus. Over and over, you had it from that prayer. From our Father, bring them forward, bring them forward. With another one is happening over there. Put your hands together for Jesus. Celebrate the name of Jesus. Jesus said, the hour has come, the Son of Man must be glorified. Here tonight, Jesus must be glorified. 
Bring them forward. We expect our region overseers and group pastors to come forward. Put your hands together. Put your hands together. No problem can stand the name of Jesus. God has highly exalted that name. And you had it from our Father in the law over and over in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. That name will never fail. Another one there. Another miracle there. Bring them forward. We want to see which she has raised up right now. That name has never failed. Please, overseers, overseers, come forward for the interview. There are many testimonies, so we need all of you to come forward. Another one there, another miracle there. No problem can stand the name of Jesus. God bless you. On my right hand side over there, I'm waiting for your clapping. There must be a miracle there. Every problem must bow under the name of Jesus. We shall must be evacuated. High blood prayer must become normal. Fire blood is melting away right now. Where are you? Where are you? Another one there. Another one there. Another one there. Put your hands together for Jesus. The name above all names. The name above all names. Jubilation everywhere. Joy everywhere. If you brought anyone that is deaf and dumb, deafness has bow to the name of Jesus. Where are you? Where are you at the back? I'm expecting your testimony. Please come forward. Come forward. Come forward. Our overseers, please let's make sure we interview the people. Any hands there? It's happening over there. The dead can hear the lame is walking. Problems are melting under the name of Jesus. The name above all names. Yes, yes, bring them forward, bring them forward. Bring them forward, bring them forward. Perfect healing. First night, multiple. Check your body now as you are praising God. Come forward, come forward, come forward. If you brought anybody with any problem, under the name of Jesus, the problem was come. Melt away. Be coming forward now to come and give your testimony. Come forward, come forward. No problem can stand the name of Jesus. You can see already. You can see joy over there. The power in the name of Jesus. Power in the name of Jesus. You had it in the prayer of the servant of the Lord, in Jesus' name. While we are waiting for the interview at the Alpha, Alpha location here, 
We are told that uh, we are taking a testimony from the online. Please, our overseer, be fast of I can take as many as possible. Begin to shake yourself now. You cannot go home with any sickness tonight. Everyone must melt under the name of Jesus. God has highly exalted that name. All right. Please, let's listen. We want to have a testimony from online. The name of Jesus walking wonders everywhere across the globe. And we bring you some testimonies right now as we're receiving on the social media. Godwin Godem had pains in the leg and in the spine. And he wrote, just tonight, after the final amen, the spine pain completely disappeared. Indeed. Glory to God. Indeed, glory to God as we bring you this from Joseph Heritage from Edde Oshu State, Nigeria, who wrote, the Lord has just healed me from an ear problem that has persisted for some time now. After the final amen, the pain disappeared, and now I have my healing. We take you immediately now to Abia State, Southeast Nigeria. Abia. I'm grateful to be here to share the testimony of what the Lord has done in my life. Deliver me from kidney problem. My name is Pastor Emmanuel Lopai from Deeper Christian Life Ministry, Abia State. In the month of July, I fell sick. The sickness was so serious in my life to an extent I cannot stand up. I cannot sit down. I was just lying helplessly. When the doctor tested me, he found out that I have high blood pressure, which affected my kidney. And then one of our uh, sister. Before that, the doctor referred me to Federal Medical Center that we should go there. Then one of our sister said, let's go to Dr. Emuche first. Then on getting there, Dr. Emuche had to confirm the kidney problem, as the other doctor have already said. I'm Dr. Charles Emuche, the MD and CEO of Excellence Med Medical Diagnosis Center. Pastor Emmanuel Opai was brought in here a few months ago by a lady nurse I know. He was admitted in a private hospital here in Aba. At that point, he was diagnosed of renal failure and was referred to Federal Medical Center, Umuahia. They decided to bring him here to confirm the doctor's diagnosis. When he came here, he was so down, he couldn't walk. He was, had general edema. I mean, he was swollen up. The hemoglobin level was low. Everything was down. Turn around the test, the creatinine was very high, uh, 3.0. The urea was about 70, and I, I gave them the result. Then my group pastor have to phone the state overseer who told him to ask me to come to secretariat because Jesus is going to pray for people that have problems. And when we came there, with my group pastor, and Jesus was connected, and he prayed for us. After the prayer, I feel some sensation in my body that I am healed. Praise the Lord. And then, to confirm, I went back to the doctor. I went back to the doctor. When, the, when I came in, the doctor smiled and said, Pastor, the Lord have healed you. A few weeks later, he came back and told he wanted to rerun the test again. When he came, he was stronger this time. Unlike what he was there, I was amazed. I was surprised. And we run the test again, found that all the renal parameters have corrected. Everything was normal at this time. Creatin was 1.2 milligram per deciliter. And also the, the urea was now 37. He was strong and healthy and sound. It's amazing. He surprised the results. Are here. What God is doing in these days through our uh, minister, uh, Dr. Pastor Ble Kumui, is amazing. It's wonderful. It's great. We oh, thank God for this great miracle. Before I cannot do like this, I cannot do anything. I cannot stand up. Thank God that the Lord has delivered me. Praise the Lord. It is amazing. We now go to the Alpha location for live testimonies. Put your hands together for Jesus. 
Did you hear that testimony tonight? From this alpha location, somebody's ear has been touched right there. Any amen coming from you right there? Yes. You will give your own testimony. So we are now taking um, testimony from the alpha location now. But while that is going on, check your body. No sickness can follow you home tonight. They must melt under the name of Jesus. I have with me here Sister Adebayo Timilein. She had partial blindness and eye pain of one year duration following trauma to the left eye. Tonight, during the pastor's prayer, she received instantaneous healing, as you can see through the eye. Please listen to her. Yes, since one year, I was in my grandma, my mom, grandma's house. That day, my mom and my grandma was fighting. I was just trying to put the set to the fight. Help her to hold the, oh, the stick like they are now using a fight does eat me in my face. And I cannot open the eyes again. The eyes was not red. They carried me to the hospital. Later, I can open the eyes, but I cannot use and see. I'm not using the second eyes and see, but I already used drug, used drug, but it's nothing. But when pastor was not praying this night and saying that healing of eyes, that she put her hand in the place that is us. When he was not praying for the healing of eyes, I put my, and I received healing in the eyes. Now I can see. Put your eyes. hands together for Jesus. Instantaneous eye, healing, perfect and permanent. I wanted a better amen from you. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Church, praise the Lord. My name is Oeda Kolo Abukumi. I come from Ishen region, Oyo State, Rawate Group, Nigeria. I, I attend Deepa Life since I was born, but all GS, all Pastor, Pastor Williams, follow Mushokumi message, did not used to enter my head. I used to commit in, I was a sinner. I am a sinner, rather. But during last month's Global Crusade, Adamawa, the Sunday worship service that our Father and the Lord preached touched my heart about a prodigal son who ran, who ran away and come back to his father. So me too. That day, the, the evening Global Crusade, I repent of my sin. I cried unto the Lord. I said, God, God, why, why, why all this? Because as I am seeing Problem, every, every day problem is affecting me. I do not have joy, I do not have peace. But since that, Adam our Global Crusade on Sunday, on Sunday, on Sunday, Adamawa, my life has been changed. Church, praise the Lord! Put your hands together for Jesus. Rejoice because your names are written in heaven. That's what Jesus our Lord said. And you are there. If your name has not entered the book of life, tonight is your night. It will enter. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Others, you will permit me to speak in my own modern tongue. Okay, hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Oh, she can wow do. Go to the bayer. Motini, Rorani, Bayer. Me or less summa. But when you're lomak with Mosara, I want to buy Jenny or me to Jomo, Joanny, Peter, Mommy. Mosara, Shubon. Be I, I shall do me bad name, Mobess, you do. And when you ask up with Mommy, she told it to petty fainty, let's say, let's say one room by man, Rara, Moon, Jen, Shubon, ten your bats in that by my room. Mo wa nfi yen so fun won sugba awon oluso agbuto mi a so so pe eh olorun ni agbara re the lord is your strength sugba nigba ti o di isoji kari aye eyi ti baba se supernatural power through christ ni o ni ile ogoni ni bori ni river state ni ojo keji nigba ti baba ti baba pada wa gba tura fu wa leyin wa sun one ni ke oni kaluku fowo si bi ti o ba ndun ko si gbowo kan soke mo wa gbowo soke oluwa isanu fun mi o tin re mi nipa ti ara 
Me, the new war, Tori Molo, see, let was so on the king shed that one aye will come. If Batimoshiro will go, what if it's more to fellow so one more repair or what in Momula could say, got a toilet shed. Consultant Timothy, I read him on my belt, you mommy, shaking for you, what dear, put your one money. Me or shed I see, come, come on. Oh, Lauron, go for me, go to soil for me if you want me. Round your king shed, you get a beam, Mopada, what's the lay? mo wa n gbadura oluwa isanu fun mi ki nse leyi nikan le ti wo e ti wo mi so sayin mo si tu fe ka se leyi ninu aye mi ni ojo keji so jiyan mo mo baba gbadura leyi ami ta se kain mo ri pe itunu o wa sinu okan mi nigbati ma fi dele mo sun bi omo tutun lati igba na mo si mo Let's put our hands. Let's put our hands together. Sister Diola Esther from Ikole Kiti. She's been suffering from chest pain and sleeplessness, insomnia of one month duration. But after a pastor's prayer. now but while that is taking place no problem we follow you home tonight Amen. the name of Jesus has never failed every problem melt under the name of Jesus in Jesus name Amen. be shaking your body right now and come forward to join the queue of interviewer and testifiers we now go online for some testimonies God is walking wonders. Let's quickly take you to YouTube where Gideon Silas said he had been suffering from depression. But tonight there has been a release, total transformation and total triumph. And he's praising God. Praising the Lord indeed, just like Favor Castle is praising the Lord as well. He wrote, for the past 15 years, I have been suffering from severe pain on my left leg. I've been to different places, no healing. But immediately after the last amen, and as my brother says, something, something about, about the final, the final amen. amen. After that amen, he got his total miracle and is completely free as the pain has disappeared. Disappearing pains everywhere, as we bring you this from YouTube. Nine years old, Akindele Taiwo wrote, I thank God for how he healed me from cough. After the prayer of the man of God, this cough has been troubling him, but after the prayers tonight, the cough disappeared and every other symptom associated with it all gone. And as the state overseer has said, it's your turn to give testimony. We return to the state overseer. Amen. It's your turn to give testimony. The Lord has opened the door of miracle for you. Nobody can shut it. Come forward as we listen to testimonies now. 
at the Alpha location. As the testimony is going on, be shaking your body. No sickness will follow you home. A better amen. amen. At the name of Jesus, every knee and sickness must bow. The next testimony now at the, other, at the Alpha location. The young girl beside me has been suffering from bedwetting since birth. Embarrassing one. When the last few months after the pastor's prayer, she was totally healed and she's sleeping well now, no more bedwetting. Let's hear from her. Thank the name of God. Oh. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. Uh, my name is Adiola Grace. I'm from Edo region. I bless the name of God for the salvation of my soul. So, and I really appreciate the name of God because what God has done in my life is a great one. Praise the Lord. This baby, uh, this girl, is a mir she's a miracle girl. Because the time I conceive her is just daddy to touch, uh, to mention my case. Then Baba mentioned my case, and that heavy bleeding disappeared. Praise the Lord. Uh, third, third day after, when I went for scan, then I said they have two weeks and two days uh, baby inside me. I share my testimony then. That was 2014 uh, December. Now, since when this girl is born, is only one I'm on her side. She used to wee wee at home. If she slept in the afternoon, she will wee. But by the grace of God, when I told October uh, GCK wants to commence, Baba said any disease that used to bring a reproach to us that we should mention it, that it will disappear. Now I went to her where she said, I said pray and touch where is, uh, you have problem. The, uh, my girl lays her hand on her stomach and he cry and he pray. Since then, that will we disappear. Praise the Lord. Put your hands together. That was a miracle, miraculous kind of, you know, the power of God in our life for the child to stop that situation. Your own situation also bringing shame to you and reproach has come to an end tonight. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. My name is Jibri Mercy. I want to testify of what God has done in my life. I thank God that I am not a victim of a speed suit. I have a problem in my eyes that whenever I look into direct light, my left eye, water will be gushing out of it. I told my proprietress, she said I should tell my parents that they should buy me glasses. I said, God forbid. I was not saying this in my mind that how can a small girl of me using glasses that is not a sin of pride the following day when Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumuyi said we should place our hand on where we have the problem. I placed my hand on my left eyes believing that God will heal me. But I thank God God healed me, and since then, I can face the red light, and nothing will happen to me. My second testimony, since when I'm seven years, the one I can remember, if I take anything cold, I will not be able to swallow even saliva. My parents usually spend money on this. They will buy drugs. This, this, this sickness usually keeps me from school, even more than two weeks. The HM already know about my issue. But I thank God. God healed me. At first, I placed my hand on my throat. I did not have any testimony. But when Baba Nas said that, if you want to give your life to Christ, raise up your hand. I raise up my hand. And after the prayer, the final prayer, and the final amen, 
I thank God that I was able to swallow my saliva freely without any, any pain. Praise the Lord. Put your hands together as you surrender your life to the Lord. Every blockage will be removed in your life, in your throat, in every area of your life. Praise the Lord. Um, my name is Paul Ubi. I was invited to this program by a friend of mine. I school in Ekiti, and I've, I've been battling with this addiction of smoking weed and cigarettes for a while. And since I left secondary school, I've been smoking. That was in 2014. I can't remember the last time I didn't smoke up to now. And funny enough, I developed this polynasa in my left, right nose, nostrils, whereby I can't breathe properly. And I was told that I would be having an operation next month for it. And when the pastor was praying, I was telling God that God, I, I think I'm done with this weed of a team. Because the pastor said something that if you, if the devil gives you something, he wants to turn your head upside down and your leg would be upstairs um, doing the wiggling and stuff. So I thought like all these years I've been smoking, it's as if um, I've not been thinking well and it's as if what the pastor said is true. Then I beg God that God, because when I came here, I have these lumps in my nose. I don't really need to put my hand in my nose. I would feel it myself. And unfortunately, when the pastor said we should touch our hands on wherever the part that we feel is not okay with us, I was reluctant at first, but I just decided to just, like, st with style, I placed my hand on my nose. Then after the pastor prayed finished, I sat down and I blew my nose. I, I can't find, like, I can't find it there again. Like, it's no more there. And I think that's a miracle for me. Thank you very much. Put your hands together. Double miracle. Deliverance for smoking and healing of the nose block. Double portion for you tonight. Tell yourself, double portion in my life. Double miracle in my life. That's an affirmation from heaven for you in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. I'm Sister Priscilla, Priscilla Imakbo. I'm a student of FOE. I want to thank God for how he delivered me and how he healed me miraculously. I've been having a sickness for, since 2020, and I couldn't say anything because of financial issues. But miraculously, this, I told him 2022, 2021 December, during the miracle um, explosion in DLCC, I told him that, God, I don't want to carry the sickness to 2023, that I should just do something for me. Miraculously, 2022, God just made the miracle, miraculous provision, and I could do the surgery. After the surgery, I had issues. Like, I couldn't eat. I had post-surgery um, uh, trauma, and... My body was just disorganized. But that day, I sat at home, because it was around August 27, I did the surgery. And it was during the time we were having the global crusade. So during that time, I listened to the prayer at home, and miraculously, God healed me. Today, I am totally healed. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. You can do better than that. Say, praise the Lord. Can we have orchestra to praise the Lord with us? Before we...
first night, multiple miracles. And you are going home now, you'll be the first to come before the program tomorrow. You want to shake up, you will see. And here we are, December 22nd, year 2022. Isaiah 22, 22, fulfill in your life. The doors of miracle have been opened, nobody will shut it in Jesus' name. Today is the first night. And as we continue, there will be what we call accelerating crescendo. Every day, tomorrow will be better than today. More miracles tomorrow. More conversions tomorrow. And you will be the first to give the testimony. Shall we all rise up and bless the name of the Lord for what he has done tonight? Let's appreciate the Lord. Let's worship the Lord. This is just the beginning. Let's bless the name of the Lord on behalf of our pastor for what God has used, how God has been strengthening him. This is just the beginning. And we are going to be witnessing increasing unprecedented strength and power through him. Tomorrow will be greater. Tomorrow will be greater. I said tomorrow will be greater. Let's appreciate the Lord. Father, we are grateful unto you. Thank you for the way you have started with us tonight. Your word will never fail. Your power will never fail. The name of Jesus will never fail. Thank you for what you have done in Jesus' name. Thank you for your mighty hand upon your servant. We thank you for the way you are strengthening him. Tomorrow will be greater than today. Tomorrow, anointing will be mightier than today. Tomorrow, inspiration, illumination, revelation will be greater in Jesus' name. And we pray, oh Lord, as we go now, we begin to witness miracles on our way home. Prepare all for the greater things you have for us tomorrow. Your name will be glorified. Oh, glory be unto you, O oh Lord, for what you have done and the way you have started with us in Jesus' name. Blessed be your name forever. Renew the strength of your servant and prepare us for the blessings of tomorrow. Your name be glorified forever. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. A better amen. God bless you. Let's say, Daddy, we are grateful to God on your behalf. The Lord renew your strength. We are very grateful, sir. God bless you, sir. Don't forget, we are taking our meal here, and uh, so that you don't go.